Hollywood marriages don't usually last long, but Miranda Lambert and Brendan McLaughlin aren't your typical pair. So are they a match made in heaven or destined for Splitsville? And is someone stepping out? Here's what we know about their wild and crazy story. It isn't unusual for two country music icons to fall in love. Just take Faith Hill and Tim McGraw, who have been happily married for decades, thanks to running in the same circles within the industry. That's also what happened with Miranda Lambert and Blake Shelton, who tied the knot in 2011. But by 2015, the seemingly happy couple had announced that they were splitting up after almost five years of marriage. And fans immediately assumed that Lambert would be taking time to mend her broken heart. But the songstress quickly started dating again, reportedly hooking up with fellow musician Evan Felker back in 2018. Then, in an August interview that year with the Tennessean, Lambert claimed she was single, adding, "...love is a hard road sometimes, and it's been a roller coaster ride for me." But as the timeline goes, she was only single for a few months before meeting Brendan McLaughlin in November 2018. And for as many ups and downs as Lambert has faced, it's clear that the stars aligned when she crossed paths with her new man. It's really good to be genuinely happy. I mean, you almost don't realize that you're not until you get there. Everyone has a relationship history, and it's not always a pretty one. For Lambert, her storied past with her ex-husband Shelton is pretty much out there and available for anyone to dig through. But since McLaughlin met his match with a big-time star, his baggage has been making headlines as well. He's been accused of cheating, and maybe didn't do such a great job of transitioning from his previous relationship with Jackie Bruno. As Jackie's mom Carol explained it to Us Weekly, Jackie was engaged to Brendan and he cheated on her and got another girl pregnant. It's all true. And, well, at least part of it is true. The outlet also noted that just three days after McLaughlin and Lambert met, he welcomed his first child, a son named Landon, with an ex. Clearly, Lambert and McLaughlin have both had some relationship issues in the past, but that hasn't stopped them from trucking on together. You might not know that McLaughlin was actually a New York City police officer when he came into Lambert's life. But now you also might be wondering how exactly a cop and a famous country star would ever meet and fall in love. As the story goes, an insider told People that the pair met on November 2, 2018, when Lambert appeared on Good Morning America with her band Pistol Annie's. Apparently, McLaughlin was working crowd control in the area at the time. Even so, considering that Lambert initially kept her relationship extremely private, it was nearly impossible to confirm that the two were an actual item. While Lambert isn't the first star to date a non-celeb, her relationship with McLaughlin was still very much low-key at the start. That is, until it wasn't. Lambert fell pretty hard for McLaughlin, and vice versa, of course. Want proof? On February 16, 2019, just about three months after the couple met, Lambert announced that they had made it official. Not mincing words, she posted on Instagram, "...I met the love of my life, and we got hitched." Obviously, this came as a huge shock to fans who didn't know she was even dating McLaughlin. But Lambert had her reasons for keeping things private. Explaining that she felt protective over her relationship, she revealed to People, "...I was married before, and it was a huge wedding, and everything was very public. So was my divorce. This is my actual life. With Brendan, I made it a point to keep it as private as I could for as long as I could." Even though the couple's wedding surprised just about everyone, there's no denying that they both seemed genuinely happy and in love once they went public. But a few months after Lambert announced the new union, rumors started to swirl that there might be trouble in paradise. People magazine even reported on gossip that Lambert was ready to call off her marriage completely. But as it turns out, that couldn't have been further from the truth. A rep for Lambert told the outlet, "...the report is completely made up. Not one iota is true. They are happy and together." Even though the relationship and marriage was still brand new, the couple didn't let the rumors take them down. Another insider told the outlet that the pair were practically perfect together, adding, "...I think Brenton provides for her a state of normalcy that balances with her life before she became Miranda Lambert." 
To say that Lambert and McLaughlin met during hectic times in their lives would be a pretty massive understatement. Lambert had recently gotten out of a relationship and was busy with her career, while McLaughlin was literally only a few days away from becoming a first-time dad. But the two seem to have taken all the craziness in stride, and Lambert has enjoyed becoming a stepmom to McLaughlin's son. Lambert made it clear that she had adjusted to life as a bonus mom just fine, telling Extra, "...my stepson is amazing. I'm loving that whole phase, and I've raised a million dogs, so I feel like that part of my womanly, motherly thing is full. So this is a whole new journey. It's great." Since these two seem just as at home in New York City as they are in Nashville, Tennessee, it's only natural to speculate on where the pair would end up spending most of their time. Lambert owns a farm in Tennessee that she clearly cherishes, and McLaughlin has a son in New York whom he wants to be involved with. So what's a couple to do? Well, it appears as though they have found a way to both be where they want to be and where they need to be. Life is going to give you lemons, period. If there wasn't problems, then we wouldn't appreciate the great days, you know? Detailing how she and McLaughlin split their time between two cities, she told Extra, "...we have the best of both worlds. We spend time in New York, we get to see our adorable nugget, then we get to come back to the farm and have the quiet life. I'm enjoying the balance." After Lambert and McLaughlin got married, the former NYPD officer went on to make a pretty significant career shift. Not wanting to juggle long distance, McLaughlin left his job after things with Lambert got serious. In fact, an NYPD spokesperson told Fox News that McLaughlin was no longer employed by the department as of February 2020, adding that his status was officially retired. Fox News also reported that McLaughlin has apparently taken on a role as part of Lambert's private security team. A source who attended one of Lambert's concerts explained, "...Brendan was the security guard right before you go in to meet Miranda for her meet-and-greet." Sounds like both Lambert and McLaughlin have found a way to stay close while maintaining their passion for their careers. Obviously, the fact that this couple got married so soon after meeting suggests that the two have a very strong connection. And nothing says true love like a romantic music video, especially when Lambert has never featured a real-life lover in any of her videos. In October 2020, Lambert released the music video for her single Settling Down, starring her hubs as her love-struck crush. Lambert dished a little bit on what it was like making the video with her actual partner, telling New York's Country 94.7, "...it's really special. I've never had a video in 18 years in the business with a love interest, and so it's kind of funny that my husband's my first one." Not a good job. Just laying here and being hot. fixed, like, my whole body. Just lay here. Lay here and be hot. Lambert joked that McLaughlin was a no-brainer when it came to casting because he was hot and available. She said, "...I'm like, you're cute, you're here, and you're free." While it's unclear whether Lambert and McLaughlin went on a honeymoon after their wedding, they sure haven't skimped on the travels since getting married. The two have not only been bopping back and forth between New York City and Nashville, but they've also set out on cross-country adventures together as well, even if it might have been because Lambert was forced to take a hiatus during the pandemic. Taking to Instagram in May 2020, she posted, "...just because I can't travel and play shows doesn't mean I can't travel and make music. I have the most amazing travel companion, my husband, and we decided to add a family member, the Airstream. I'll be pulling this rig all over the country. I know that seeing the world through the windshield again will bring creative vibes." Whatever the circumstances, the two clearly enjoy spending time together on the road. And that sounds perfectly country, and pretty darn romantic. These two definitely had a whirlwind romance, but fans also wonder if they're going to move as fast with having a family. Then there's the question as to whether they even want to have kids at all. McLaughlin, of course, shares his son with his ex, but does that mean the couple won't be expanding their own family anytime soon? Well, according to one source, McLaughlin and Lambert are reportedly ready to give it a go. Back in May 2020, the insider told In Touch that the pair was supposedly in the process of trying, since Lambert had, quote, baby fever. They added, "...Brendan and Miranda don't see the point in waiting around to have children. With everyone being on lockdown, the timing couldn't be better." I got the dogs, you got the kid, we can just make, we can mix and mingle, it's gonna be great. 
That's a big change-up from where Lambert stood on the kids' issue when she was married to Shelton. Back in 2013, she told Entertainment Tonight, "...our dogs are our children and we kind of treat them that way." Whether or not Lambert and McLaughlin will hold on to that family-focused vibe now that she's back out on the road and touring the world, looks like we'll just have to wait to find out. Like just about everyone, Lambert and McLaughlin spent a whole lot of time at home during the COVID lockdown in 2020. And at that point, the pair had only been married for about a year. Since Lambert was unable to travel and perform live, they made like the rest of us and sheltered in place together. But as Lambert tells it, the time off actually brought them closer together. She shared with Country 94.7, "...if newlyweds can survive a pandemic, then I think we're good, you know? It's a good test." Lambert also explained that the downtime was actually a pretty nice change for the usually busy artist. She recalled, "...the first month I had a lot of fun. Well, not fun, but I was like, okay, we're off. We'll probably be back on the road in a couple of months." It was just us two with no distraction um, at my farm outside of Nashville. And Though the lockdown certainly wasn't easy for anyone, Lambert and McLaughlin made the best of the extra time together, and managed to strengthen their bond even more. Even the most low-key fans of Miranda Lambert know that the country singer is passionate about animals. Like, really, really passionate. Especially when it comes to rescuing dogs. So naturally, McLaughlin got in on the animal rescue action when the two got married and moved in together. But you might not expect that he's almost as hands-on as Lambert is when it comes to four-legged pals. In June 2020, McLaughlin spotted a kitten abandoned on the side of the road and brought him home to Lambert. The pair named the cat Tequila, of course, and have happily welcomed the new addition to the family. Noting that her Mutt Nation company had just branched out with a cat food line, Lambert shared with People, "...Tequila is adjusting perfectly to farm life and loves hanging out with my dogs. My husband found him at the perfect time. Needless to say, he has been eating well." While they may be an odd couple when it comes to matches made in Hollywood, it seems these two are keeping it as down-to-earth as possible when it comes to their unlikely and totally blissful romance. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite country music couples are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.